This video class will introduce the practitioner to Harage's theory within Aikido Jutsu. Thus, all explanations belong to the first steps to comprehend the execution and performance of those techniques. Now, deeper explanations are components of others, higher level classes, as they demand much more complexity to understand as we consider that they work together with anatomical, physiological and breathing details. All technique can be applied and all application can be efficient. It will depend of the way we thought, the way we express ourselves uh, within a technique when we use our biomechanical system to confront the UK's body in a specific performance. The angles applied by the Turi must be verified before he starts the vantage of moving first, at least inside the timing of UK's movement. A good technique is first of all rational. It means that if the technique hasn't been well understood in a coherent way, the conviction to execute is unstable and undefined, which will lead the practitioner to inefficiency. Another point to consider is the fact that a good technique must have a beginning and an ending. The movement should be clean and the energy should be conducted with objectivity. As this class is for beginners, our argumentative explanation will only bring into sight the primary reflection about the theme in question. It's very common to see how practitioners without experience execute a simple technique that requires a higher level or more complexity of understanding and during the trajectory lose the energy or dissipate it interrupting the proper way to perform it. Once the energy key starts its process, when activated, the bigger the capability of flowing, the bigger is its reverberation through all technical movements. The steps always should be precise, as this will affect the way they receive the Hara energy. All movements in a common way have a straight line on their trajectory, a shorter way to achieve their point. And this line is the limit for flowing of the key to run through a natural performance and conduction. If the shorter path is ignored, it will support the dissipation of the energy by parallel ways or consume. Although Yama Otoshi and Yama Orosh belong to the basic study of Aikido Jutsu, we can consider those two techniques with high complexity level of explanation when we learn to fragment each step to reach a proper execution. When considering traditional manner of execution within a technique, it's also necessary that identification of three parts that structure it. The first one, the Tsukuri, is the base of the whole technique development. Without this perfect execution, the rest would be badly made. The Tsukuri, as the first entrance, determines how the Tori will conduct the UK's energy and through which ways the energy or key will move or be stagnated.